Good morning and welcome back. It is currently 9.45 in the morning and I woke up like 15 minutes ago. Today we are going to be doing a full day in the life of prep. Two and a half weeks out. Ah! I'm so excited. It's getting so close. But yeah, that's why I'm up so late. Um, these last like weeks have really been just like killing me. I've been sleeping for 11 hours and I am not exaggerating. Like I will go to sleep at 10 or 11 and not wake up till at least nine. So doing good on the sleep, which is important. Um, first things first, we are going to go weigh in and do a check-in for my coach. I'm hoping for a pretty low number, but the scale is a tool. It is not the end of the world. And if I don't weigh in super low, there's other variables and factors that could contribute to that. So let's go weigh in and hopefully it doesn't ruin our day. Woo! Oops. I am very happy with that weigh-in and how it went. 126 is on the lower side for me. I've been weighing in at like 127, 128. So I'm super happy with that. Let's get a little physique check. As you guys could probably tell from my puffy eyes, I'm extremely tired still. So first things first, we need coffee and we need it now. I personally don't mind black coffee, but it's definitely not my first choice. So to be a prep friendly, healthy girl, um, I have been doing, I literally do instant coffee powder because I'm lazy. I put two teaspoons in with a packet of stevia, some cinnamon, and then this shit. This shit is fire. Zero calories. It's glazed donut flavored. It's probably jacked up with chemicals, but that's alright. Not really concerned about that. So that's how I make my coffee. Oh baby, look at her go. So satisfying, you're welcome. Coffee's made, dues are paid, time to get laid. <laughs> I'm such a good freestyler, fuck. Ah, oh, shit, all right, coffee is done. Now, usually at this point in my morning, I like to sit down and do a little bit of content work on my computer and write in my journal. Always, always, always start the day with journaling great way to just get your thoughts down, set an intention for the day. We love, we love a wellness queen. Um, also, if you guys are new to journaling or want to start doing it, but you don't really know what to write about or blah, 10 out of 10 recommend this journal. First off, you can customize it. So like when it says Gracie Hart Daily Journal, and it's so pretty. And then inside there's just things like your intention for the day, um, activity, self-care, what went well today, thoughts and feels. You have a section to write down your goals. <laughs> I have one goal, <laughs> to become an IFBB Pro Bikini Competitor. That's it so far. <laughs> I've, like This is like kind of my prep journal, but... Um, yeah, so this is how we start the day. Let's eat breakfast because I'm hungry and I need food. So breakfast today and every other day for the past 12 weeks. 
has been egg whites with a slice of turkey bacon or ham and oatmeal. So we got all of our little ingredients and it's time to get our Gordon Ramsay on and get cooking up in this kitchen. Um, I'm currently eating like 1300 calories a day, 160 grams protein, 100 to 120 grams carbs, 25 ish grams of fat. That's like a a ballpark for you guys because I don't have the actual numbers out in front of me, but let's get to it. There you have it. We have our breakfast for the day. I think it actually looks pretty good. So I'm gonna scarf this down. Then uh, once we finish breakfast, I'm actually just gonna go head over to my apartment treadmill, get some steps in probably only for like 30 minutes or so because at 12 o'clock I have a cycle class. So we're gonna get some steps in, go do our real cardio. <sighs> Let's do this. We have made it to the treadmill. We are moving and grooving. Um, I have been on the treadmill for probably two hours a day now. Um, I have to do 20,000 steps a day, so this is the only way we get it done. I basically just randomly throughout the day hop on the treadmill. And a huge thing throughout this prep also has been boredom when I do cardio. I am like, what the fuck do I do while I'm on the treadmill for an hour? I've done movies, podcasts, um, homework, work, and now we're on to reading. So I've been literally going through books like crazy, just standing here on the treadmill reading while I walk. So we on this muff and treadmill, then we're gonna go to cycle, and by the time all that is done, and wrapped up, we should be on to meal two. Oh, oh my fucking God, that shit was hard. Cycle actually like murders me every single time. Let's go home, let's eat meal number two and then we have treadmill time. Wow, I am looking rough. Still, I've given up on looking good um, throughout the days now because once the cardio is done, it's just like downhill from there. I'm just beat. So, sorry. Um, lunch, 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 lunch. Literally a handful of lettuce, four ounces of chicken, and a low calorie dressing. So, that's it for lunch. Um, that definitely won't fill me up very much, but that's okay because I don't need the fuel until my workout later. So I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna hit the treadmill for an hour, relax, and then we lift. Hour on the treadmill it has been completed. I have now been in bed for the past 30 minutes, just trying to let my body wind down a little. But it's time to get up and get ready for the gym. We got to pick a gym fit. We have to eat. And we're actually not going to be making a pre-workout stack today because I have a new obsession, which I will show you guys later. But let's get this ball rolling. All right, all right. Here is our gym fit on the new camera, though. Quads. Quad check. We got back day. Let's do it! Also, you guys may notice in the next clips that my outfit is different, my hair is different, everything's different. And that is due to the fact that yesterday I attempted to film my booty workout and I stupidly again filmed it in the Instagram frame. So that's what happened there. <laughs> Literally just tuna straight down the packet and I take this like let me just show you guys um like hidden valley ranch seasoning and I just season it and then instead of pre-workout I have literally been obsessed 
with these. They taste exactly like a Sour Patch Kid. And they have 200 milligrams of caffeine, carnitine, which is like a um, thermo thermogenic. Therm yeah, that word. Um, so it heats your body up. Makes me sweat a shit ton. But honestly, I think I've just really been liking these in prep right now because they're sweet and they taste like a Sour Patch Kid and I don't get to have anything like that. So that's my go-to for the gym right now. I'm going to eat this tuna and I will see you guys once we get to Muscle Factory. I'm fucking dead. I'm so tired. I don't even want to finish filming the rest of this video, but I'm gonna push through. Filming can be really hard on prep, especially when you're just like no energy. So I'm sorry if the last of this video is me like dying, but I'm gonna shower and then we're gonna have meal four, which is five ounces of 96 lean ground beef and a half a cup of rice with some veg. Before I completely forget vitamins, let's go through them. Um, fish oil every day, vitamin K2 and D3 every day, um, a probiotic, this is a must every day um and then i do apple cider vinegar and turmeric so those are all my vitamins and i also take glutamine and creatine every day and what i like to do is mix this in with um my gorilla where is it there she is the amino acids and it's you know, it gives you everything you need. You get your aminos and creatine and glutamine. So that's what I drink post-workout usually. That's a big meal right there. Mm-hmm. This meal is by far my favorite one of the day. Um, post-workout meal is always the biggest one for me. So I love this meal. I have one more meal left in like an hour or two. So catch you then. I know, you guys are probably thinking, another outfit, Gracie, what happened? Well, it is a different day, again. I have now filmed pieces of this video in three different days because I'm so fucking dumb. I swear my brain just doesn't work anymore because of prep, so that's my excuse. Luckily, food-wise, I eat the exact same thing every day, so last meal of the day here, we just got a bowl of chicken with whatever kind of rice that is. I forget what it's called. And um, some greens. That finishes us off for the entire day. Once and for all. Anywho, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I appreciate you tuning in and watching. I love you guys, and 
stay tuned for next week because we are gonna be two fucking weeks out from our show less than less than two weeks so it's gonna be a hot one i love you guys and i will see you next time grack is out